It won't be a new accessory for the space station in the near future, but a group of researchers at the University of Saskatchewan is getting close to hitting the mark. Professor Gordon Sardi and his team have been developing a wrist size MRI fit to be installed on the International Space Station at some point. He explains the reason a wrist MRI would be useful in space is because you can tell through a wrist if bones and muscles are deteriorating. Even if it doesn't go to space, though, Sardi adds there is another goal for the project. It's a research project to push the technology of MRI in a direction where eventually we'll have something small and portable, easily affordable, easily accessible by everybody. If they can achieve a smaller MRI, it would be very easy to put into small towns and remote locations. Associate Professor Michael Bradley says they have made good strides with the project and it's been a great learning tool for students. We've got uh, two teams working on it. A graduate student doing his master's on a new coil design. And then we've also got an undergrad group that's doing some work on a measuring system to enable us to make accurate measurements of the magnetic field. So it's early days yet, but uh, we're actually making a fair bit of progress. Right now, the images the wrist MRI produces aren't very clear, which is why improving the magnetic field and clarity of the images is next on the to-do list. Carol Thompson, saskatoonhomepage.ca.